Here's an app I use to add static content into a component slot. I wanna say a big thank you to Bradford Huber who shared this idea in our Discord channel. I'm gonna launch the slot drop app. And from here, if I have the slot selected and insert an element, it adds it as a sibling of the component. But if I add another component into the slot, like a heading or anything else, now with that heading selected, I can insert a sibling and I have a static element inside of the slot. I can delete the original child component. I can add other static elements like collection lists, custom elements, and anything into that slot. And this also works with the page slot. So if I select any child of the page slot and insert something like a section, now I have this static element here that's inside of the page slot. And if I head over to build mode, I'll notice that I can move these other sections around. So whether that be above or below other sections here, um, but the section itself, the static one can't be moved. So to install this app, go to the Google Drive link in the description below and download the zip file. From there, we'll head over to Webflow under apps and integrations and develop. We'll create an app and here we'll name it slot drop and we'll add any kind of description and any website URL. And we'll go ahead and just upload an image uh, for our app icon. We'll hit continue and we'll turn on designer extension and then we'll create the app. And from here, we want to click publish extension version and we want to upload our zip file and we'll upload that zip file right here. And we'll go ahead and add any kind of comment and we'll click upload. And from there, what we want to do is install the app on our workspace. So for these three dots, we can click install. We can either install it on individual sites or on the entire workspace. And that's how to add the app.